Hello again and I am back with a reflex site this time. Uh, now this uh, I made very recently and it is very special in the sense that uh, this does not need a dedicated light source uh, to, uh, to make the reticle because it has this, it uses ambient light uh, it has this little fluorescent tube which I found in a Star Wars set that collects the light around it and glows green which makes the little reticle that you will hopefully see right now can you see it? yes I think there it is wait a minute there, there you can see the little uh, green reticle so now this is again a reflex that is that has no parallax at about 15 meters and it is, the, it is about 11 o'clock here right now so we'll go and check the parallax tomorrow this is for all those who didn't catch the reticle earlier here it is and I'm focusing at infinity right now so it is in sharp focus and the side itself is all blurry and let me just zoom in on that there you go there it is we'll do a parallax test tomorrow so how does this work? well again the principle is the same your targets are mostly at infinity so you have to place the reticle at infinity so that the reticle does not have any parallax uh, with the target so to do that the reticle is here this small green dot you see there which is uh, and the rays coming from there are made parallel parallel using this concave mirror and which reflects it off to this sheet of glass very special sheet of glass semi silvered uh, which reflects half of the light back to your eye now this semi silvering thing is very important because otherwise most of the light rays will just pass through and you won't get to see anything now a uh, special thing about this is that since it uses ambient light to create that reticle which means that uh, it uses light all around it that already exists to create that reticle that means that you can use it in almost any light conditions except of course darkness uh, and it also adjusts the brightness of the dot according to the light co uh, conditions uh, around it and you may have noticed that earlier in my, in my red, do red dot sites reflex sites actually uh, reflex sites I did not take them outside because the setup was just too dim for the uh, bright sunlight outside but this thing will adjust even to the sunlight and uh, in uh, and even outside you can see the reticle just as clearly as in here it is a very cloudy sort of overcast kind of day but how does that matter we are here to check the parallax <coughs> i've focused it on that wall Mm, which is about 20 meters away this is the site there is the dot you can see that it's not moving at all as I move the camera the sun has come out right now and so we are going to see if it works just as well in bright sunlight not that bright in sunlight as it did inside there is the reticle
good thing about this site is that it even looks somewhat like a reflex site unlike my previous reflex sites and it has got uh, elevation adjustment so you basically just twist this thing to make this dot go up or down and uh, I can't wait I can't wait to make a gun around it but I just don't have enough time for it uh, 